Uh, all right, guys, something new to the channel, uh, nothing to do with RC today. Just want to give you guys a heads up. I'm going to be putting in a home network system in here. Uh, right now, I've got my real link security system. I'm going to put a server rack here with switches and manned switches uh, so I can manage everything. It's all going to go up, up there and down here where all my wires are. I currently have everything down in the the living room, which is not an ideal spot for me, so I gotta rerun ethernet cables. I got the rack on its way. I'll get the hardware later. I gotta redo this whole closet, but we should uh, be in good shape to do a better um, job and faster internet's coming. I'm doing this, guys, to get faster internet. I'm having that come fiber optic in the next three months when it's available in my area. They're just putting it in the ground right now and almost completed. Um, will allow for better video for me to increase speeds, uh, downloading, uploading, so I can make more videos and hopefully uh, helps out with everything around the house. All right, guys, this is where I house everything. This is my modem. I've got the router up there and I will be switching everything over into that closet. Gonna be getting rid of this unmanaged switch, going with a managed switch so I can be more secure with everything, less of everything. So I'm gonna be swapping all these wires over, putting them upstairs in the attic and into that closet. I'm also going to have three access points, one in the basement, one on the first floor, and one on the second floor to get perfect uh, Wi-Fi. So stay tuned for uh, the build. Okay, I got the rack up. I got the nav point. Um, this is a 9U rack. Um, I got the wires moved. I had the wires over there. I'm going to have to fix that hole. Now I made everything nice. I'm going to have wires coming in there and there. That goes to the lower attic, that goes to the main attic. So everything's coming except for the major hardware, the switches and stuff I'm gonna have to wait on after Christmas. But for right now it came out good. Once I get the shelving, the real link uh, security system, camera system will go up here and it'll look a lot nicer. All right, switched everything over, got the modem in. Still using a uh, cable modem, so I only have a one gig set up. Uh, waiting for the stuff for the rack still, but uh, everything's running. Um, everything's wired. That's how it's gonna look, through the walls and through the ceiling, because I've got two attics, a lower attic down there, and then an upper attic here. So there's wires going everywhere for right now until I get everything um, set up permanently, but Everything's functioning correctly, so that's what I'm doing. So, and then I got two switches. I've got a PoA, PoE switch to run uh, a couple items that run off of PoE, and then I got uh, a switch for everything else. They're man unmanaged switches, so nothing to set up uh, internally through programming, but that's later to come when I get my real system set up. All right, it's coming along. Uh, I got some of the stuff from Amazon. I got the patch panel. I got the shelf. Um, and shelf's actually up here holding the real link camera system. My modem is a one gig from uh, Spectrum. Uh, and I got the surge protector in. Um, just to get keep internet running, uh, I have a Netgear router, which is going to be changed out for a TP-Link router and controller and switch, managed switch. The two unmanaged switch I have here right now is Netgear. This is an eight switch. Um, and then this is an, a four, uh, four switch panel, but it's PoE. So power over ethernet. So I do have that for one AP uh, access point down in the basement. I'll have all my access points to a PoE switch to run my uh, wireless network. Uh, all these run, I have two um, attics, one down here. So that's where these wires are and they're gonna get all tied up and then up in the main attic right there, will get all tied up and nice and neat once this is all hooked up shortly. 
All right, one of the last pieces of the puzzle that I ordered is a 3D printed, 3D printed uh, rack mount that will hold my router and the controller. And let's open her up and see what we got. All right, opened it up. Again, if you guys wanna know, I got this uh, on Etsy, Hive Tech Solutions. What a nice 3D printed uh, part, quality here. Um, again, the 200, OC200 controller will go there. And my router, which is a multi gigabyte router, which if you guys wanna know is the ER707-M2. Uh, Omada system, so gonna fit this. And the last thing I'm waiting for is just the PoE switch. All right, finally completed the network rack. You got the patch panel. I have the TP-Link Omada. If you're wondering, it says SG3218XP-MT2 model. It's got 16 PoE plus and six, sorry, eight PoE plus, eight regular, all hooked up to all everything grounded. These are hooked up to my access points. The, I am using a TP-Link ER707-M2 router. And again, as you can see, they fit perfectly in that 3D printed uh, panel that I bought. Also got the Cyber Power um, surge protector and my real link for all my cameras, security cameras. And again, you can see how neat it is. Before I had all those wires, they're all gone. Now it's just neat. You can see it's tied neatly up there and neatly down below. Still working on that, but again, in all, looks great.